she wasn't the area where she's at, but she's where um, she she kept um, a merchant um, on a some some kind of a building, kind of a part of a building like that, a wall, okay, part of a wall, um, one of those elements of the building. Um, so she kept him at the top there, and I helped rescue him. So this is the kind of fight that you get when you when you do that. So. But you're going to find out what the trends are actually uh, week 2 because you're going to find out what uh, to use against the fade that is going to come out after uh, we're done with this one. So um, just hang out with me, okay? Alright. So normally I like to go for Inspire Courage to increase my level of uh, destruction. And then I'm going to go ahead for, and I'm going to use... the damage that they're doing. Um, as you can see, most of my people are here buffed. Hold on, why is she not buffed? Why is everybody else not buffed? Uh, okay, I think I just because I started the game, that's why. Sorry about that. So normally they're supposed to do a pre-buff. It's not as if I'm cheating, it's just a pre-buff that I literally like to have in the game before I start anything. So, she will have to go backwards. And if you notice anything about me, is that I always strategically try to make sure that the, the enemy comes to me so I can maximize the amount of damage that I do. Okay. We're gonna still chill, let them all group up and see what happens. What I can do here, instead of allowing this clown to come forward, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get somebody here to play with them. Okay? That's the main thing. And then I send this guy backwards. And then that'll be it. Please go over here. Thank you. I'm going to play with him a little bit. So as you can see, there's someone on the whatever. They feel okay. Even at this level, um, shield, and then we get up front here so that we can block some of this pain. And then I'm going to use an item, hopefully. One of my items here, I got to have. Uh, I just had. I just got shield, right? So what I'm having, I have shield on me. So what I can do is I can take some for strength, a drink, and I can take a potion of aid. I have five there. I'm thinking about going in a large person, but then it will keep me weak to a certain degree. So I'm going to just have to chill on that one. And then I take some drinks that keeps me going. Alright. Now, could I hit him? Sure. But I didn't want to do that. For Valerie, I make this and I come on out. She's gonna take this one. Okay. This is going to be my own man, this is the first time he's going to be here. Uh, I'm going to do this, wasp, and then I'm going to get closer. This should Hopefully do he it. he's not able to hit me. Alright, first person I want to kill is this guy here. I want to take him out, but I want Lindsay to go first. The reason why I want Lindsay to go first is because I want to, I want to also apply what we call um, haste. So if you're strategic about this, you can actually tell that you know I think about all my moves if I'm so that way you have all your people's you know in good uh, good distance. Then you can have to put up. And 
that's it. All right, it's time to fight. So this guy's gonna be next. If I hit this guy, I, okay, go. Awesome. Brought him down a little bit. That's fine. Oh no. If I rush this guy, if I rush him, this guy hits me, but I get a five hit on him. Giving this guy no chance to assist him. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. So that's how I do it. You have to think about every move you make. Almost every move you make, you make think about it. Think about how you affect the move in general. Alright. Kubo. Can you trip this guy? Okay. I can't trip him. Well, he's gonna hit, get the hit on somebody. Oh, snap. What? You didn't hit me that much? Let's see someone trying. He missed with a slam. He had a 10 bonus. He was so lucky he got a 27. My ammo class is 27. So he did some damage. He did some damage. Alright, cool. But it didn't affect me that much though. So at this point in time, I'll go ahead and heal my guys. Because I know what's about to come next. And I move my character this way. And stop him. Don't do it. What are you doing? Amiri, you have to wait for this guy to come. But in the meantime, we're gonna try to get this guy. That guy is distracted, let's go. That's right. So we're gonna go for war. We're gonna do this. Do this. this is why I like this archaeology. Even though I took only one one stage in this um, uh, archaeology this thing, but the lock actually increases my distance. I'm thinking maybe, just maybe, I can actually increase. Can actually increase. Um, I hate this, right? I already hit it. What's my damage now? My damage is 19. 19 value. What was his defense when Amiri hit him? His defense was... What was his defense? Amiri just hit him. Is that not here? Is that Amiri? I'm really just hit him. Yeah, Frost, okay, so you just hit him. He's a class is 27. With a 19, I need to just do a 10. I'm going to do a stunning fist also. Where's my stunning fist? Where's my stunning fist? Let's like go. A That's why I love this thing. Once you start to understand the builds, you understand how to build them so that they get you what you really need. But let's be frank about it. Let's look at the build here. Base attack. Because of the amount of monk that I have, 8 in monk, if you look at the character. <coughs> if you look at the character, how much level do I have here? I have uh, 1 in fighter, right? 1 in rogue. And then the remaining is a monk. And then one should be in bard. There should be one in bard. Why does she have eight? Thank God. Is it because of the monks? Does the monk have anything? I, I don't. Three levels in other places. Why does she have a BRB of eight? She should have a six. So that's level 7, right? I'm at level 7, right here. So it should at least be 7, not 8. Why does she have a 1? I still don't know. 
I still don't know where the one is coming from. Maybe it's from fighter. I don't know, they don't, they don't tell me how to, so, so my initial calculation was wrong then. Because other, other players were like the same thing. But anyway, let's move on. Um, dexterity is plus 3, which you can see here. Um, archaeology, which I showed you guys. That's why I like the archaeology class for the uh, bards. The morale from Good Hope from Lindsay. At the plus 2. Lindsay again plus 2. Means she's also a bard. Then the haste from Lindsay. And then from the karma that I'm using, the one handed weapon that I'm using, gives me a 1. Puts me at 19, gives me a clear hit to continue to hit. And when did I get this item? This item, I got it in the barony, capital barony. So, there you go. Alright, moving forward. Let's go, let's go, people. You've had your laugh. You've had your laugh. Let's go forward. I'm gonna stop right there, let's come to one side. Uh. Serves you right! Okay. The Kundayo. Send the message. Oh. Sebastian sending the message. Sebastian sending the message. You gotta send that message. We're just gonna stand in front here. And we're gonna chill. I'm not gonna rush him. I'm just gonna chill. I can rush him now. I fight him, but I'm gonna cheer. Let him come to me. To many of the time, people want to rush in. But the reason why I'm rushing up on top to this point is because I know that the fate is gonna get up here. And once she gets up here, I'm rushing her immediately. So I'm going to go over here, and then I'm going to drop uh, these guys somewhere around here. Only three of them with someone. Oh, bloody hell. I'll keep him busy. Okay, Miri, let's go. We're gonna chill and we're gonna be nice about it. Yeah? Let's go, let's go people, let's go. Let's go. Just one more turn. And I'm going to use Sense Vital. Yeah, go ahead, use my people. Enjoy yourself. In fact, I'm coming for you. Here we go. A calculated risk. That's right. I'm not gonna use Lindsay yet. I'm gonna skip Lindsay. I'm going to use Pixie Dyer to complete this mess. Alright, woman. Uh huh. Well, I got it. Alright, people. I'm going to leave my man. I am going to send a message right here. Three. Let's pop him. Let's make him happen. Uh -huh. Okay. Should I let her go? Or should I go after her? I'm going after her. I'm going after her. I'm going after her. <laughs> Why is Lindsay off? What happened to Lindsay? Mm -hmm. Oh no, she's been fascinated. <sighs> this is not good. I'm going this after. will hurt. Why? Why did I miss? Why did I miss? Please, why did I miss? What the hell happened? I have a, a attack bonus of twenty-three. She is nineteen. How did I miss? Are you kidding me? Yeah. I'm 
even me. She's flat for the she's 19. How could I miss? Oh, this game, this thing is pissing me off. How the hell do I miss? How? Look at this. Look at look 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 at the numbers, man. Guys, come on. She's 19, I'm 23. I'm really above her right now. I'm above her. And I miss! How did you miss? How did you miss? How did you miss? Every other person is not missing. You're missing. Mm -hmm. eh? Now, I'm a class is not at all. How did I miss? No? How did I miss? Do not falter! <laughs> 231, okay, I'm believing it. Four, okay, I agree. But why did I use that one? Why? Alright, boys, let's go. <laughs> so this on hard difficulty, as you guys can see, this on hard difficulty, it's not as if I'm playing on easy mode. It's on hard difficulty. You can see that, it's on hard difficulty. Where did she go? Can you pull shit on her so we can walk? Her wheel is good, fortitude. I can use. Ah oh, man. I can use um, snowball. Oh my god, image cold. Oh no, snowball won't touch her. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, snowball won't touch her. Alright. Let me use bone shot around. What? I didn't overcome the the resistance. Okay. Okay. Alright. Send a message. Always send a message. Always send a message. She has already fascinated, fascinated my life. So that's gonna be it for today as you guys can see i just took out this princess and i'll be putting down uh, the location of where i took her down so she didn't drop anything no 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 item of what in due time none of her creatures dropped an item of what can you imagine this shit? this guy better be worth every penny man i'm telling you this guy better be worth all the penny. Serious. With all the resources I used, I spent more than that. Like, hey, return on investment, man. Return on investment. I spent more than that. This is a bad return on investment. I'm telling you. All right, guys. It's been a pleasure. I'm your host, Gaming Odyssey. And I'll see you guys next time. Catch you later.